Cold temperatures, not only dangerous for us humans, but also for our pets. Savannah Harrison joins us right now to tell us how to protect the loved ones if they have to be going outdoors. Savannah, good morning. Good morning. Well, many of us want to make sure our pets stay safe and warm, especially during this bitter cold. And so the three important things you need to remember, food, water, and shelter. Now, veterinarians recommend what's called a double entry dog house. That means the dog has to turn the corner when they enter the dog house and then lay down, especially if your dog is an outdoor dog. Inside, consider using a heated pet bed or blankets. Straw is okay, but it can have bugs or pointy bits that can irritate the skin. As for water, use a heated pet bowl or buy a bird bath heater. Those can keep your pet's water defrosted during the cold months. And for food, vets say you may want to give your pets more calories since they burn more in the cold weather. They're going to burn twice as many calories when it's cold just to shake and keep their body norm, warm. Now, I still don't want them to be overweight, but I want to add enough food. And so sometimes if you can feed them in the morning and feed them a little bit in the evening, and maybe you do add a little bit of, you know, uh, chicken stock, chicken broth to the food, warm it up a little bit, make it a little bit more appetizing to them to offer them more calories. Now, if your dog is an indoor dog, when they go out, you might want to consider a sweater or booties and make sure you're washing their paws when they come back inside to loosen up any snow, ice, or salt that is out on your sidewalks. Of course, you know your dog's tolerance best. Some dogs can handle the cold more than others. Reporting live, Savannah Harrison, KY3 News. Savannah.